Hey guys, Prithi Raj here. So now that we know the ROG phone is now officially available in Malaysia, the price for it starts at 3499 for the 128GB version and the 512GB version comes in at 3999 Now it's definitely a performance-centric smartphone and it's a stellar smartphone for gamers out there. Now beside me you see this suitcase and this suitcase contains all the accessories that's going to be available for the ROG phone later in November. So how about we open it up, take a closer look to see what's inside. And you're watching The Adventures of Vespa. Let's begin. Now this is the ROG suitcase. I mean, it's pretty obvious, right? So you have the ROG logo in front, and on the side we have this TA lock, which is pretty much normal. And on top you'll see the ROG naming branding so basically it's the Republic of Gamers so this suitcase will be sold for 599 ringgit if you really want to get it and um, yeah and yeah it has the gamer accent to it and the best part is I think my personal favorite is definitely the black finish with the bronze accent on it so this definitely looks beautiful now moving on to the suitcase inside so let's open it shall we so the lock is here and uh, moment of truth, and there you go. So let's go one by one. On the top, you'll see like four stuff, and on the bottom, you'll see three stuff located. So starting from my right, we have the ROG phone, followed by the YGIG display dock. Next up, we have the Twin View dock, and the mobile desktop dock. There's just so many docks in here. Um, and uh, next up, on the bottom, we have the phone case itself, followed by the GameWise controller and an ASUS professional law. We're going to be opening one by one except for the phone because we have reviewed the phone so you can check out our review. So let's jump right in. We have the phone here so this is pretty much the phone package. If you want to know more about the phone, if you want to check out the review you can head over to our site to know more as well. So moving that aside, let's take up my personal favorite which is the mobile desktop dock. Now this is probably the most interesting dock that I've seen so far. Now I have to sit like this. <laughs> There's just so many things to handle. Okay, so this is prob uh, this is probably one of my personal favorite accessories to begin with because of the fact that how much port it has. So it opens like this, and that's pretty much it. And that's the dock itself. And then you have the manual and the warranty card and whatnot. So that's not really important. So this is the dock itself, so this is where the ROG phone goes into place. And yes, you have an Aura Sync light on the front with the logo itself. Now as for the port itself, you have abundant amount of ports. So you have a microphone port at the back, a headphone jack, an HDMI port, a display port, and an Ethernet cable. And it has four USB 3.0 Gen 2 port a Thunderbolt port and another display port on the side. You have a USB 3.0, the ones that you find in a hard drive and an SD card slot. Then you can actually switch between a PC and a mobile um, option. So the button is located right here up at the front. Now this is the dock. Next up, we're gonna check the Twin View dock. Now the Twin View dock is basically a, uh, uh, a dock that has another display at the bottom so it's a lot easier for you to do your streaming and whatnot and it's also nice to actually play another two games at the same time I mean we haven't tried it but it will be nice to try it so that's the turn it on as beautifully the pack as beautiful the package is I have to say this is possibly my second favorite um, accessories uh, this is possibly my second favorite accessory from Asus and uh, there you have it. So this is the dock itself. So the moment you unlock here, this particular top will go up and down. So you have to slide the phone inside, lock it, and this will turn on right away. So the moment you turn it on, you'll actually get a dual display. So the front up, the, the display up top will act as the home display and you can access all the applications at the bottom display. Now it connects with the 48 pin USB Type-C pin that we, have saw, uh, that we have seen in the ROG phone. And as for uh, the ports on this, you have a headphone jack right up at the front. On the back, you have a USB Type-C port followed by a SD card slot. Yeah. 
And then we also have this triggers, which is the left trigger and the right trigger, which is easier. And it's nice to have because considering the fact that this is a mobile uh, gaming uh, gear, so it definitely makes a lot of sense. So this is the second accessory that we have been seeing so far. Now the third one we're going to open up is the YGIG display dock. Now this display dock, what it does, it actually allows you to stream all your shows or whatever game that you're playing onto a bigger screen. Now the best companion for this is definitely the game mice itself. Now opening up, you'll see this. This is the YGIG dock. So this uses an A02.118X instead. So this gives you better streaming because the RG phone supports A02.11AX for better streaming. Now to the bottom side of it, we have the ROG phone case. Now, Malaysia, uh, Malaysian viewers, you will be able to get the case right away, which is included inside the box itself. So this is the case, and we have two more. Now this is the game wise. Now this game wise is basically a controller for your ROG phone. Uh, it's a controller, pull it out, connect your phone, and you can use it as a game wise. So you can control your game, like playing a Nintendo Wii U or a Nintendo Switch. Yeah, because the controller looks pretty much similar to that. So you have the X, Y, A, D. Um, then we have the uh, arrow key. Then we have the joy joystick looking thing. And then we have the L1, R1, L2, and R2 key as well. So last but not least, we have the Asus Professional Dog. Now, if you're somebody who invests a lot of time on productivity, this is definitely for you guys. Um, so in this dock, we have a series of uh, ports. So starting off on the side here, we have an Ethernet port. And on this side, you have a few more ports. You have an HDMI port, you have two USB 3.0, and you also have a super fast USB Type-C port as well. Now this is definitely an interesting dongle to have. And there you have it. These are the accessories that's going to be available with the ROG phone itself. So these accessories, like I said earlier in the video, will be available starting in November. Um, you can buy it separately, uh, like let's just say if you need just a professional dock, you can get that as well. If you really need just the twin view dock, you can get that as well. So that's pretty much it. Are you planning to get any one of these or are you planning to get all of these? Let us know in the comments down in the description below. If you like us on our Facebook, follow us on Twitter and our Instagram. If you have any sort of question, feel free to ask down in the comment section below, wherever you watch this video. And uh, we'll definitely catch you guys in the next video. Until then, this is Vidira just hanging off. Take care and I'll see you guys real soon.